Yo, what is up guys? It is Joji back with another video and today I will be showing you guys my drift car collection in Southwest Florida. Now, as we see right here, I have a hundred cars in Southwest Florida, which is a lot. You know what I'm saying? That is a lot. And I just want to give a huge shout out to everybody who's in the stream because I'm recording this video on stream. Shout out to Mike. Shout out to uh, Panda. Shout out to everybody in the chat right now. Shout out to Pro. But without further ado, let's dive into this and let's get started, man. Here we go, man. Shout out to Shaquille Oatmeal as well. Shout out to everybody. Liam, Ja, Trevor, Aaron, Jet. Shout out to everybody, man. But as we can see, we got a lot of cars. And we're going to be going over every single car. So starting off with the first one, we're going to do by classics. And then we're going to go down to coupes, hatchback, and all that good stuff. This is my R34. This thing is a beast. The gamer fan, thank you so much for a $1 donation. I appreciate that, bro. Everybody like that super chat if you have not. Um, but yeah, this is my R34 Z Tune Limited. Very good at drifting. Then starting off with this next car right here, we got my Limited Ford Mustang. I think this is a drift car, if I'm not mistaken. Wait. Oh yeah, it's a drift car. It's a drift car. Textures aren't loaded in on the wheels, but it's fine. Then we got my 250 GTO, and you guys, I don't know if you guys would be surprised by this, but uh, this is a drift car. This is actually, oh, yeah, yeah, it is. Okay, for a second, I was like, wait a second, is it? And I was like, yeah, no, it is. I did make this a drift car because, you know, I'm Joji. I like making everything a drift car, and we got so many more. All right. Yo, Cameron, thank you so much for the one as well, bro. I appreciate that. Everybody like up that as well. But with this next one, we got my Plymouth right here. This is my Plymouth Roadrunner Superbird. Very good at drifting. This was one of my favorite cars to drift before I actually had a drift tune. As you guys know, I drift with a drift tune. But before I had a drift tune, this was like one of my favorite drift cars, surprisingly. I don't use it that much, but it was good. Then with my next car, we got my BMW M6. I'm pretty sure this thing, yeah, this is a drift build. This is a drift build too. This is a beautiful drift build. I love this car. Very nice. Then, moving on, we got my R32. Pretty sure if you guys have been watching me, we know this car. There's not really much to say about it. It's a beast. Then, with my next car, same with this. R33. Use it all the time. Those are, like, my favorite drift cars. R34, 2, and 3. Best drift cars. Then, with this next one, we got the Nissan Skyline. Okay? This thing is a beast. It's not the best at drifting due to the fact that it, it's an older car and it doesn't really have ABS. Which does play a big part when drifting because when I'm holding drifts, I usually hold down the brake and gas at the same time. As we can see, when you do that with the car, no ABS, or if you have the ABS off, it kind of stops the drift as we can see. So yeah, just wanted to point that out. But with the next car, we are in the coupe section now. Now we got the GT500, beast of a car right there. 350Z Nismo, another beast of a car. Now, a lot of my coupes are drift cars, but we actually don't have two right here. These are not drift cars. Move, wait, wait, there, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, no, it's saying a drift car. It's saying a drift car. For a second, I thought it was. But this is a drift car right here. We got the BMW M3 GTS. This car is a beast. Yo, Caleb with the five. Hey, Joji, first time watching your in game stream. Love you. Yo, thank you so much, bro, for the five. Everybody, like up that super chat. YouTube just added this feature where if you donate, you could like super chat. So that's pretty dope. But yeah, man, we got a BMW M3 GTS. This car is a beast. Moving on with our next car is the Mustang Convertible. If you guys have been watching me as well, you will know this car. Amazing at drifting. I love dropping the roof as well. Take a look at this. You got to drop the roof with it. Then, once you do that, just swing, dude. Just swing and you could fit a bunch of people in here too because it's a four-seater which is super dope But moving on to the next car. We got a Nissan 350z Nismo another very good car. I love this build bro I love the build we got going for it. it's just not it's not white the car is not white It may look like it is but if you pay close attention, it's kind of like a darker white It's almost like a silver not silver, but like it's not white. Okay. Just want to make that clear, but we got stock rims on it, and this car is so good at drifting. I mean, take a look at how smooth that is, bro. Then, next car right here, CLK AMG. This car is such a good vehicle. Just such a nice car. We don't have that many 63 AMG vehicles within this game, so I'm very happy that we have this one at least. I hope they add more, but, you know, they can't really add real-life cars, so I don't expect it. But, speaking about 63 V8s, speaking about just V8s hey, in general. Gigi, first time watching your stream, <laughs> loving, smiling face, red heart. I appreciate that, man. Everybody hit that like and subscribe button in the meantime. But yeah, speaking about V8s, we got my E92 M3 right here with a V8. This thing is so nice at drifting, bro. Very good. Then, next car 
car right here. G37, man, one of my favorites. This thing's very good at drifting. Sounds nice, it's loud, looks nice, and that's all I gotta say for it. Then we got a BMW M3 E46. Not the best at drifting, I'll be honest with you, probably because it doesn't have the most amount of power, but I like it. I like it. It's very good. Somebody asked, how long was your longest drift you've ever held? I don't know, bro. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know. That's a good question, though. Now, Hellcat Red Eye is actually not a drift build, but this is a drift build right here. Arc 7. Very nice car. Then we got my Aero Nomad. I just made this a drift build yesterday, actually. Hold on. Wait. Wait. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Yo, we're hitting that. I don't know where the sound went, but it doesn't matter. Because, yo, that's crazy. All right. Uh, TRT Spec 5. Obvious. 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 Obvious drift build right here. I mean, come on, bro. This thing is just like money, bro. Yo, shout out to Jet as well for the Aero Nomad drift build idea. Uh, here we go. Code Red. Actually, no, that's not a drift car. Not a drift car. Just remember, it's not a drift car. But the 1M is. This is a nice car, too. I like that. But we got a scat pack. This is a drift build, actually. This thing is not the best. Compared to my other drift builds, it's not the best. I mean, it is a boat. Okay, we, we do got to take that into consideration. This car is a boat. But it's still nice, bro. Very nice car. I put a supercharger in it. So it's kind of like a Hellcat now, I'll be honest with you. Anyways, we got an M4 right here. Very nice car as well. Very good at drifting. We got a Cobra right here. And I also want to give a huge shout out to Mike. Yeah, Mike gave me the idea to make this a video. So shout out to Mike, bro. Oh, yeah. Cobra is a banger of a car right here, too. Then, let's see. Let me get the music back. Kind of forgot about that. We got um, regular Dodge Challenger Hellcat. Oh, I love this build, bro. The brown with the right white rims is just so fire. Let me know if you guys agree with this. Is this a clean Hellcat? Let me know. Let me know what you guys think. Like, I don't plan on changing that build anytime soon. That's fire. Speaking about Hellcats, we're going to get into my other Hellcats later. We do got a lot of Hellcat drift builds. But, yo, next car, we got a 370Z right here. Very clean. Yo, I got to speed this up, though. We got a S15 Classic Joji Drift Car. Then we got an M4 right here. Another classic Joji Drift car. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen those a lot if you guys have been watching me. Then with our next car, I think I made my M2 a drift build not too long ago, if I'm not mistaken. Did I? Yes, I did make this a drift build. I barely use this car. I'm going to be honest with you. Pause the music. I think this is one of my least used car that I own. It got to be one of them. I don't know why. I just don't use it. I just don't. But speaking about other cars, I don't think this is a drift build either. I'm pretty sure I converted this to a street build yeah 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 it's not a drift build but this is a drift build right here 350z can't go wrong with the 350z i mean it's such a good drift car bro seriously moving on to our next car got the s class s class coupe very good at drifting as well i made that thing a rear wheel drive we got a srt8 right here oh man this is clean. wow i forgot how good this car looked seriously the purple it's like a bluish purple i don't know if you guys could tell Dang, I gotta use this car more. No, this is clean. Let me know if you guys think this is clean. I, I genuinely forgot how it looked, my build. I thought it was orange still, but that was the old one. Then we got my G35 right here. Very good drift car. Not really much to say. It's pretty straightforward. Then we got my Pontiac GTO. Another very good drift car. Then we got my Lotus right here. Very good drift car. We got my Ford Mustang GT. This is a drift car, but this one doesn't actually have my drift tune because this is a takeover build. If you guys know... You may have seen some videos on the channel of me doing takeovers with this car. And that's for one reason. You know, this car doesn't have my drift tune, but that's because it could hit rollback. I mean, take a look at this. Wait for it. Wait for it. Look at this. Rollback. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. I can even harder. Hold on. I can hit the harder rollback right here. Yeah. Look at that, bro. That's beautiful right there. That's why I love this car, bro. Seriously. This car is super fun to drive. And it just hits the rollback, bro. It really does. Anyways, next car right here, we got Mustang GT 350R. Not much to say. Very good drift car right there. Then we got a TRT Spec 3. Got a lot of Mustangs now thinking about it. We got an RX-8. Okay, beautiful. Sylvia K's right here. The S5, uh, S13. Yup, S13. I almost forgot what this was for a second, but we don't talk about that. Then we got my regular Cayman GTS. Just made this into a drift build the other day. Same with the Boxster right here. That's a drift build too. 
Then we got, uh, that's not a drift build, that's just stock right now. But moving on to hatchbacks, I actually don't have any drift. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I knew it, bro, I knew it. I made my Volkswagen GTI a drift car, okay? I did rear wheel drive swap this thing. <laughs> it's actually pretty good, bro, because this thing's light. It's, it's kind of like an egg, if you guys know, you know. But yeah, no, this is a good car, bro. Seriously, 360 drift right there, clean. Clean. Anyways, that's all my hatchbacks. Then moving on to hyper cars. Now, you guys may or may not be surprised. May, probably not surprised. I do have some drift hyper cars starting off with the Apollo. I just made this thing, I think like three days ago, two days ago. Literally just made this thing into a drift car. I mean, take a look at it. It's wild. It's seriously wild, bro. Seriously crazy. I mean, you don't really see these too often, but we also got a Bugatti Chiron right here. This thing is crazy as well. I actually made a video on my Joji Beats channel about drifting this. Then we got my LaFerrari. This is also a drift car. Wow, wow, what a surprise. I got everything a drift car. <laughs> now, nah, I can't remember if anything else is. I don't think this is a drift car. Unless I'm crazy. Oh, yeah, it's definitely not a drift car. Okay, that's all it for the hyper cars. Now, pickup trucks. I'm Joji, so I obviously got a drift pickup, you know what I mean? We got the F-250 right here. This thing could slide a little bit. It's not the best, I'll be honest. Could slide a little bit. Take a look at this. Wait for it. Oh, God. Oh, God. Wait. Wait. Okay, there we go. We're sliding it. There we go. That's all I needed to see right there. I needed to make sure we still had it. We also got the Dodge Ram SRT N. Uh, N? N? I meant 10. Forgot to pronounce the T in 10, but... This is a very good drift car too. Probably my best drift truck that I own. Yeah, no, this thing's a tank, bro. This thing is a tank. Woo! 360 as well? All right, next car. We're on to the SUVs. Of course I do have drift SUVs. Surprisingly, I have this. I need to sell this thing ASAP, bro. I never use it. When I said this is, uh, when I said the BMW M2 is my least used drift car, or car in general, this is, bro. I think I've driven this car probably three times since I bought it, and it came in the update, the latest update. Yeah, no, this thing's trash, but I made it a drift car. I'm just not a huge fan of it. I'm probably gonna sell it right now, bro. It, it's not even that good at drifting. It sounds like a Supra, though. It does sound like a Supra. Listen to it. Okay, you guys hear that? Now listen to the M4. I mean, Z4. God, what's wrong with me, bro? Hold on, wait, listen to this. So they sound the same. So I'm kind of convinced that they may or may not have the same engine. <laughs> Anyways, let me sell that piece of junk right there. Boom! We also have a drift. Wait, wait for it. Wait, wait. Okay. Wait, can this drift? Oh, it's stock. Oh yeah, yeah, it's stock. No, no, no. I can't. It can't even drift, chat. It can't. It can't. All right. Let's go ahead and throw that thing into the water. Oh well, I guess it's gonna stay there now. But I do have a drift track hawk. Take a look at this. Wait, they actually do have a BM- they have a B57- Those things actually have a BMW motor? I didn't know that, bro. I, I just know they sound the same. I had no idea, bro. I might have to do my research after this. Oh my god, the Trackhawk, though. Such a good drift car. And that's it for my SUVs on the drift vehicles. Um, now moving on to my sedans. Got so many. I think almost every single one of my sedans is a drift car. We got the Hellcat right there. Um, we got the limo right here. We got the, what else? Other regular Hellcat right here. This thing is so nice, bro. I love the brown. Then we got my Tesla Model 3. Yep, Drift Tesla, you already know. Then we got my M5 right here. Then we got my, is this? No, I don't think I made this a drift. I should make this a drift car. I'll convert this thing into a drift car, literally. If I, yeah, I got to. I think I must. I got to, bro. Let's do that right now. I'll do it quick. I'll do it quick. For anybody wondering, I'll show the drift tune as well. If y'all want to know how to drift like me, I got you. Chevy person, what is up? Limo can drift. Yep, yep, yep. I do have a drift limo. I know. Might, might be a little might be a little surprising. But at the same time, I'm I'm Joji, so like I kind of uh, have everything a drift build. But yeah, this is how I make a drift build as well. So you wanna go ahead, yo, do this. Okay, get a little bit of brakes. I like to just fully upgrade the vehicles, you know? So then we'll get some drift tires right here. Okay, transmission right here. Suspension, I like to lower my cars a little bit. Okay, we're gonna lower that all the way. 
Oh, not all the way in the back too. Dang, bro, this thing's kind of stanced out, honestly. Oh my, bro, this is low. Oh, <laughs> look at that. That's nice. Are we clipping at all? No, I don't even think we're clipping. Beautiful. Let me know if you guys like the fitment and all that stuff. I kind of like these rims we got. Not bad. Anyways, aside from that, then you want to go over here to the steering, okay? You want to get your tune going right there. Boom, 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 boom. We got the tune, bro. And just like that, also got a rear wheel drive. Swap it. Just like that, you got a drift car in like, what, a minute? Pretty quick, honestly. But yeah, look at this thing slide now. Let's see how she drifts. Oh, that, that's so beautiful. That's so beautiful. Oh, hold it! Oh my! Wow, that's nice right there. We like that, we like that. Anyways, next drift car, we got my G35 right here. Beautiful drift car, I love that thing. Then we got the Magnum. Then over here, we got... My Ultima is not a drift car anymore. We got my Evo right here. Amazing got drifting right there. Then we got my S-Class. It's not loaded in. Sorry. I don't know what's wrong with my textures. But we got my other Evo. That's another good drift car. And then we got my Dodge Charger SRT8. So those are all my sedans. Then for supercars. Now, I do actually have a good amount of supercars that are for drifting. We got my SLS right here. We got... What else? I can't remember exactly everything. Pretty sure these are not drift cars. This is a drift car though, my 650S right there. Very good at drifting. What else do we got? We don't have that many drift supercars, I'll be honest with you. Got a drift Viper right there. This is a very good drift car. We got my SL65 right here. Look at this thing, Colleen drift car right there. Got the 4GT. Surprisingly got a GT3 RS. Just made a video on my Joji Beats channel about this thing. Then we got my Ferrari F12. I also made a video on my Joji Beats channel about that car. Then we got my GTA Spano. And then that's it for the Supers. Now my Vans. We got a Drift Pacifica. And that is it for all of my drift cars in Southwest Florida. Ending it off with a bang with the Pacifica right there, man. Make sure you guys hit that like and subscribe button. Comment down below your favorite drift car, okay? Let me know, man, out of all the cars that I own, which one is your favorite? Me, personally, I think my favorite, for anybody wondering, is the Nissans. Either the R34, 2, or 3. Those are my three. Those are my top three. Or the S15. S15 is very good, too. And I like the M4. So, yeah, let me know what you guys think about the Drift collection. And without further ado, go watch this video where I show you guys me going to a private street takeover.